and it's liftoff. NORAD satellites are picking up heat signatures from Rudolph's bright red nose. Santa and his nine reindeer are full of energy and are ready for the long haul ahead. From the North Pole, we suspect from years past that he'll fly down into the Pacific Ocean, to the coast of Russia, through the Bering Strait, headed south to the Marshall Islands. Even loaded with all the gifts and goodies, Santa's sleigh seems to be moving fast. Stay tuned at NORADSANTA.ORG as we continue to track Santa on his Yuletide journey. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm Tech Sergeant Lucas Bullen. NORAD suspected Rudolph would lead Santa's sleigh over the Pacific Ocean, and that's exactly where they are. If you thought that Santa wouldn't make his way to all the little islands of the Pacific, then think again. He absolutely loves making these stops because he gets to warm up a little and smell the beautiful fragrances of each island. Santa's always looking for additional places to vacation on his off-season. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm U.S. Army Major Mike Humphreys. NORAD Santa cams have captured these incredible images of Santa flying over Auckland, located in New Zealand's North Island. From here, Santa works his way south. After visiting all the cities of North Island, he'll arrive at South Island by flying over Cloudy Bay to pick him. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm Joyce Franklin. Santa has arrived in Sydney, Australia. Santa probably wishes he could stop to listen to a concert at Sydney's famous opera house. He will leave and return to Australia a few times because of the many time zones on this giant continental island. Children down under are reminded that Santa enjoys cool drinks with his snacks because it's summertime in the Southern Hemisphere. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm Navy Lieutenant Commander Sean Kelly. NORAD satellite technicians love to track Santa in Japan. That's because we are able to use a special mathematical equation to determine Santa's speed. Through keen observation of the bullet train in relation to Mount Fuji and Santa's sleigh, we have calculated Santa's speed to be greater than 100 times that of the bullet train. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm U.S. Air Force Captain Randy Norton. Santa is in China. Our records of tracking Santa during the past five decades show that he enjoys seeing the man-made wonders of the world. Santa will fly for hundreds of miles along the Great Wall of China. After enjoying the architecture of the Great Wall, Santa will continue north into Russia. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm Joyce Frankovitz. NORAD satellites are alerting us that Rudolph, the rest of the team, and Santa are now over Perth, Australia. It looks like Santa will soon be making his way north into Malaysia, Thailand, and Laos. At this point in time, we're not sure whether he plans to head back south or go north for China and Russia. Keep tracking with us as we monitor Santa's flight path. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm Air Force Lieutenant Colonel Dick Fulton. Santa is traveling through one of the coldest parts of his journey, the Himalayas and Nepal. Santa must be very thankful for his warm thermal jacket, mittens, and hat. The reindeer eat 
lots of vegetables throughout the year to ensure they are healthy and strong in these freezing temperatures. From here, Santa will continue south for India and then to the islands in the Indian Ocean. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm Air Force Staff Sergeant Jeff Fitzmorris. Santa has not encountered any difficulties so far during his journey around the world. These images were captured in India at the famous Taj Mahal. India has a population of over a billion people. Santa and his team of reindeer are making very good time and are actually a few minutes ahead of schedule. Keep checking back for updates on Santa's location. For Nora Track Santa, I'm Navy Paid Officer Jason Morris. Santa has soared 240 miles above the Earth to visit the International Space Station. He understands the importance of what the astronauts do to make the world better and shows his appreciation by visiting them here. What a great view Santa has of the world from so high in space. After leaving the space station, NORAD expects Santa to enter Northern Africa and Europe within the next couple of hours. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm Staff Sergeant Craig Kim. <laughs> Santa is now cruising over the Mediterranean. And the NORAD satellites are watching Santa as he flies over Athens, Greece. The very first Olympic Games were held in Athens in 1896 reminding Santa that it will be time to get into shape after all the cookies he'll eat on his journey tonight. Santa always flies over the Acropolis and sees the ancient ruins of the Parthenon when he's in Athens. He loves it so much here because of all the history. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm Commander Mike Harrison. <laughs> <laughs> NORAD Santa Camps are watching Santa as he flies over Johannesburg, South Africa. Johannesburg is the largest city in South Africa and it was home to the 2010 World Cup, which Santa, Miss Claus, and all the elves watched from their humble abode in the North Pole. Many of you may not know this, but Santa is very much a fan of sports, though he prefers watching them rather than playing them. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm Master Sergeant David Griego. <laughs> Santa is now over Florence, Italy, the birthplace of the Italian Renaissance and one of the most beautiful and artistic cities in the world. Santa loves all the museums, buildings, and bridges he sees from his sleigh when he flies over Florence. He especially loves seeing the Cathedral Church of Florence, and he is amazed that it is the largest domed structure built out of brick and mortar in the world. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm Gunnery Sergeant Ryan. <laughs> <laughs> NORAD Santa Cams have tracked Santa traveling over Eastern Europe, and he is currently making deliveries near Berlin, Germany. Santa loves the fairy tale castles he sees when he flies over the German countryside en route to Berlin. And he knows to keep an eye out for the Statue of Victoria riding a four horse chariot atop the Brandenburg Gate, one of the capital's 14 original city gates. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm Chief Petty Officer Angela Baker. <laughs> Coming from the north, Santa has entered France and just flown by the Eiffel Tower in Paris. Children throughout France should be in bed soon because Pierre Noël as Santa is called in France, can only deliver toys when they are asleep. France is home to the world-famous Tour de France, 
a grueling three-week, 2,240-mile bicycle race around the country. Santa travels more than 91,000 miles in just 24 hours during his trip around the globe. We're not sure how he does it, but centuries of flying must have made him a great pilot. For Norat Trek Santa, I'm Lori White. <laughs> Santa is moving quickly tonight, and the NORAD Santa cams now see him flying over Barcelona, Spain. Barcelona is on the eastern coast of the Iberian Peninsula, and Santa loves the warmth he feels as he flies over this Mediterranean city. Santa always shields his eyes from the bright lights of the Sagrada Familia, the famous basilica designed by Antoni Gaudi, which has been under construction since 1883. Santa can't wait to see the building when it's finally complete in 2026. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm Lieutenant Colonel Misty Stoll. Ho, 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 ho. Leaving North Africa and the Canary Islands, Santa has entered Great Britain. That's England, Scotland, and Wales. Nord's analysis shows that Santa's on time and should be crossing the Atlantic Ocean very soon. There have been no delays for Santa here in England, and the rest of his journey is expected to go very smoothly. For Nord Track Santa, I'm Air Force Lieutenant Jody Vasquez. Got it? All right. After heading south to the South Atlantic Ocean, Santa has entered South America and is delivering presents throughout Brazil, the continent's largest country. Santa is just about halfway through his journey, and NORAD is keeping its satellites fixed on Rudolph's bright red nose. NORAD fighters will be taken off soon to escort Santa as he nears North America. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm Air Force Lieutenant Colonel Roberto Garza. Santa is now traveling over the mountains of Machu Picchu, Peru, home of the ancient Incas. Santa loves this South American site that features ancient ruins and the largest and best preserved city of the Inca Empire. It has been a long night for Santa, but this view helps him relax as he continues his trek across the world. Santa and his magical sleigh expect to zoom up and enter the United States very soon. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm Lieutenant Colonel Roberto Garza. Wow! Santa has just been sighted off the coast of Florida. He has finally arrived in the United States and into U.S. Northern Command's area of responsibility. Our Santa cams are detecting him flying over NASA at the Kennedy Space Center. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm Lieutenant Colonel Roberto Garza. Bonjour, comment allez-vous? Santa has just headed north into Canada. NORAD's operations center in North Bay tells us he paused to take a three-blink turn around the CN Tower. According to the Canadian Forces pilots who are escorting him, he just dropped off a load of hockey sticks for some late-night hockey players on a frozen pond and is now making his lightning-quick stops in people's homes. Soon, he'll be heading for Niagara Falls and then, we expect, to New Jersey. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm Major Darlene Pelletier. Santa is in the Big Apple. NORAD analysis has shown that he spends a little extra time here for two reasons. 
First, there are so many homes and apartments to visit. And second, the reindeer love to circle the Statue of Liberty and fly slowly over Central Park. From here, Santa will continue north into the Canadian province of Quebec. For Nora Track Santa, I'm Major Lum. <laughs> Santa and his team are now in friendly Manitoba, and for a special treat, they are going a little slower than usual over Reindeer Lake. This is very exciting for Donner and Blitzen because they both have relatives who still live here. From here, Santa will continue through Saskatchewan and head south for Colorado. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm Air Force Staff Sergeant Jeff Fitzmorris. <laughs> NORAD Santa cams are watching Santa as he travels across the United States, and they have spotted Santa maneuvering around the Willis Tower. What was once called the Sears Tower in Chicago, Illinois, this 108-story skyscraper is the tallest building in the United States, and the fifth tallest freestanding structure in the world. Santa enjoys the windy city of Chicago, and although he loves his cookies, his favorite treat when he's in the city is a slice, or two, of the world-famous Chicago deep-dish pizza. Mmm. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm Lieutenant Commander Bill Lewis. Ho, 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 ho. Santa and his team are now in Mexico City, and for a special treat, they're going a little slower than usual to make sure they visit the 8 million plus residents that live in the city. NORAD's tracking fast as Santa quickly makes his way to each rooftop. From here, Santa will continue to head north for Colorado. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm Major Marcel Farley. Santa is super excited to be in the state that is home to NORAD. The Santa Cams has spotted his sleigh high over Denver, Colorado, and know he's headed towards NORAD headquarters building in Colorado Springs quite soon. While we're sure Santa will check out the many sites of downtown, his favorite fact about Denver is that it is one of the healthiest cities in the United States. In the off-season, Santa enjoys hiking on the many mountain trails throughout Denver area national parks, and he loves taking a spin down the Rocky Mountain ski slopes. Maybe this year he'll try snowboarding. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm Senior Mass Sergeant Dwight Strode. <laughs> Santa has covered all of Canada and has been spotted entering the northwest portion of the United States. NORAD Santa cams have captured these amazing images of Santa as he makes his way around Seattle's Space Needle. From here, he should head down the Pacific Coast toward California and then in the Pacific Ocean. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm Lieutenant Commander Gary Ross. Santa's arrived in Hawaii. He must be tired after such a long Yuletide journey. When he's finished delivering gifts at the islands, he's been known to do some backtracking to homes where children had not yet gone to sleep. After that, he'll go home to the North Pole for a well-deserved rest. This ends our Tracking Santa mission at NORAD for this Christmas season. The men and women of NORAD wish Santa Claus and everyone around the world a very Merry Christmas. For NORAD Track Santa, I'm Craig Savage. Ho, ho, ho.